that's the game. I guess the game's taken over here. I, um... I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay. It's not loud, isn't it? <laughs> let me, uh, let me work with this. Sorry. There we go. Jump scares on. Interesting. How's the music? Is it still really loud? Game is dog shit, by the way. <laughs> That's funny, dude. I feel like I have someone who comes in and says something like that every time I sit down with a new game. <laughs> Loud now, right? I mean, this isn't gonna be the game. It's not constantly having music while I'm playing. We're in the menu. Ah! Croc Panther Edge Capital A K Cipher. Thank you guys for the resubs. Bob Ross is part of the five. It's your boy, English Bob Ross is part on the mail. Gonna keep the stream playing in the background while I make a game to keep me positive. While you make a game, huh? Could it be Tio's game? You're on my list, Bob Ross. Game isn't dog shit, by the way. That's good to hear. Uh, not have a... Didn't have a good day, so as always, it's very good to have some positivity and laughs from your streams. Good job. Thank you, Pablo. Daddy Leonis with the three. Might not be here for the rest of the stream, as it's my mum's birthday. Will you be tweeting the teams who got picked after stream? Uh, yes, I'll do. Uh, probably, I'll probably do a tweet like that tomorrow. Get people hyped and stuff. Thank you for the three. Have a good uh, mummy birthday. Hitachi with the 39. Just would recommend for anyone who likes Pata, Tio, Katie, and Alex. Go to Alex's channel and watch the quiz that Alex made. Great VODs. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. If you didn't catch that, you should totally go watch. Totally? Totally go watch it. It's the 39. Baker Joke with the 5. Zelda Master with the 8. Watching with my brother and my cat today. Hell yeah! Wanted to congratulate you on kicking Corsair's ass for kids. Great jo job to you and the community. Hell yeah! The Lazy Project GS Pop. Thank you guys for the resubs. And Croc Panther. Thanks for the gifted sub. Let's put me in the corner here. And let's play Scrutinized. How's that? What does scrutinize mean? Um, I don't know. Let me guess. Scrutinize means... Oh man. This... Event was totally scrutinized. And that means like it was... Overwhelmingly criticized. Shat on. Completely devoured. Critically devoured. Targeted, yeah. Am I correct? Yeah, basically. Yeah. Cool. Got it. Let's play. Alright, I asked Flash to play jump in with Fall Guys with me. When she was a kid, Luna aspired Yoink. to be a superhero. Not the ones in skin-tight suits that could fly, but the ones that identified connections Luna. where others didn't. She wanted X-ray vision to observe criminals when they tried to hide from the law. 
and supersonic hearing to listen in on mischievous talks, then a measure of heightened strength to restrain the guys bigger than her. This was all she craved when she was a child. As she became older, her ambitions took a more realistic approach, which seemed in direct opposition to the surreal tone the news took. The facts became the new dystopian fiction. The world grew louder each year, apparently more violent or more visible than the year before. Her generation grew up looking to cull the increasingly violent trends that saw mass incarcerations, drug wars, and serial killers studying to gain notoriety. Luna took the Yoink. analytical <laughs> I have this playing through my Feeling speaker really loud. Processing case files, there evidence, <laughs> and connecting dots. Her cousin, a sister almost, enrolled in the academy and became an officer of the law. Even extended family, no matter how far away, seemed to gravitate towards law enforcement. Almost as if it were in their blood. A murderer becomes a serial killer with just two more kills. A co-worker informed her over scones and coffee one morning. This one had three total that day, but that number hit double digits soon enough, accumulating corpses of officers, criminal lawyers, and several field investigators to a growing pile of victims. The news on TV becoming more unreal as the years ticked on by. Yeah, the encoding is going to be shit on this, guys. The bit rate. Story 24 7. Luna knew about the local serial killer. More so than most, thanks to all the overtime spent processing corroborative evidence for their many crimes. However, it still felt more like gossip and fabricated plot points. At least, until that phone call made something so artificial an actuality. The call came in the middle of the night. As unexpected as a bullet in the dark. Her cousin, the exemplar of a police Yoink. officer, had been killed. It was just the tragically common traffic stop gone wrong, or armed robber with a weighted pistol. Maybe Luna could have mourned and pushed on, but it wasn't any run-of-the-mill incident that was so characteristic of headlines. No, it wasn't that because life had long turned into a phantasmagoric nightmare. Phantasmagoric? Revered by all that mattered, died at the hands of the Blue Blood Killer. Who he was, or who they were, remained an enigma, despite their murder spree eroding through states, counties, and homes. But more than the long list of confirmed victims and possible connections Luna herself had registered and slept away, this monster killed Sarah. Somehow, that turned the boogeyman into a living, Yoink. breathing threat. No longer was this tyrant a thing she filed at the end of the day. It wasn't an obsession of the media. He was here. And if not in the literal sense, then definitely in her mind. This realization yep. Yep. gnawed at her for months after the real morning faded. Luna's acceptance stage barely registered <laughs> before she fell swiftly to anger once again. Yoink. And it never genuinely went away. Luna craved a name. She wanted to know who killed the sweetest woman in the world, <laughs> despite so-called dirty cops walking free. Luna needed Yoink. justice. Mm. What was it about her cousin that triggered this killer in the first place? Could it be that she stood for everything a cop should be? A perfect example of morality, protectiveness, mentality, and heart? Yoink. Officer Youngman was everything demanded and the ones that protected them. And Luna wouldn't allow her memory to fade away as another statistic. Day in and day out, she spent the connection she built up to work and rowdy Christmas parties to see if there was something no one else saw. Cop friends that never steered her wrong came up empty-handed. Yeah. Family members with careers linked closer to the real action knew little else than the papers. Mm -hmm. Even the old-timers that knew things few else did all but shrugged when she pressed okay. them for clues. She needed leads first, but there were none. So, in a last-ditch effort, she resolved to chew her boss for leeway. Luna did all she could for any little morsel of information, regardless yeah. of the fallout. Being an investigations analyst for the district attorney's office had its perks, but it only teased her for all the good it did with building an idea of who this killer was. Her boss knew what she was after, but he followed the rules as strictly as Luna did. Being shut down by him just meant there was one less layer between a law-abiding citizen 
in vigilante justice. Yeah. With okay. each denied application for information outside her classification, Luna saw the justice system's holds appear and broaden. Yep. Sometimes the law hindered what mattered. Progress couldn't always continue behind red tape and protocol. Perhaps in cases like these, rules were meant to be budged. Okay. Maybe she couldn't talk her way into databases and case folders. Maybe it wasn't so easy as to read reports on other victims. Yeah. Hoping a eureka moment hit her. If she were going to make any change, it had to start with her. Yeah. With citizens, citizens willing, willing to, help. to help. Yeah. yeah. Yes, Luna, Luna respected yeah. the law, and she would uphold it as Sarah would have wanted. But she couldn't stand idly by any longer. So it's One time. One morning, to okay. she called in sick, made flyers, and pinned them around town. She started a neighborhood watch that day, and by the next day at work, <laughs> Luna couldn't think of anything else. Yeah, so she it she started with one report. Yeah, exactly. Then two, then three and four, and more. Before she realized right, what okay. was happening, her small network of retired cops and nosy neighbors had become a full-on crime watch program wow. that spanned beyond the neighborhood, the suburbs, and into town. At times, the number yeah, of so she's got a whole thing. She's much for one a whole like whiteboard with all these the kind of fucking of pins and like, oh, this guy called him for this, this, this. Yeah. Was. Luna felt that a couple of sleepless nights was the least she could do. Yeah. Luna had to get her answers. Somehow. She took law into her own, her own hands. Okay, nice. We did it. That ends part one of my walkthrough of Scrutinized. The I prologue. Here comes, here's night started. one. Yeah, night one. Let's do this. Let's take a little break. God damn, dude. Who the fuck? <laughs> I mean, like, Yoink. so much information. And I feel like I got the gist of it a quarter of the way through. <laughs> like... <laughs> Ash, let's make it a little bit more exciting, shall we? You did indeed, dude. Thank you for the $50 donation, man. I think I think we're excited now. I think we're real excited. Much love to you, Ash. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy yourself. Please sum up the intro. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay. Um, Luna liked... So Luna, to sum it up in a few sentences, Luna liked crime, and she was keeping an eye on this blue blood killer, whatever his name is. And it was all, and she liked the crime, and her family is in police. And, um, and her family liked being police. Everybody became police and detectives and stuff. And then, but, it, but, but, but at the end of the day, Luna went to bed, you know, because it's all a, a, a fun hobby. But then one day, crime came to her doorstep, and Sarah her sister or cousin, a police officer, died. And that's when it turned personal. And she went to police. She went to neighbors. She went to people. And she got them to uh, contacts. And she has a whole network of information and contacts and crime people. And now she's looking for the killer. She's looking for killers. And that's it. Why didn't they just do it like that? Remove the intro. Throw me in there. Oh, is she a cop? I missed that part. I thought that she was just doing it as a hobby. I guess it's a hobby and a, and a job. I'm genuinely sorry, I know you want to see gameplay, but I'm uh, meeting my brother tomorrow and he's just asked when we're meeting, so let me, give me, uh, give me 30 seconds. Are we Luna? Yeah. Because you would have complained about there being no backstory to you. That's why they hit you with all that. Yeah, I, I get it. It was just a funny way of doing it. Just like a, an essay as soon as you start. <laughs> um, 
Thank you guys for the resubs. As there was a big long intro, I will read them in a little while. Let's get into um, the game. Can you see me? Is lighting good? I could turn myself up a little bit. Uh, reminder to chat not to tell me what to do. Well, there's my computer. Game likes. Hair? Beanie hat? Color? Face mask, black clothes, white. Serial number, trace root root. Oh, fuck that. Okay, yeah, we're closing the windows. So it's welcome to the game then? No. It's different. Someone said it's as if... Uh, I was reading the reviews and I saw a lot of comparisons to it being like a horror game mixed with... Um, Papers, please. Let's find out. Here we go. I hate that I can't look- I can't look more down than this. So like, if I want to click on this... Alright. Oh, yeah. I need to read that email and check out those bolos. Okay. Yoink. Let's check out the bolos. Ah, uh, here's the email. Lights throughout my home are randomly turning off without me touching any of my switches. Also, if I leave my security camera light on too long, the breaker trips. I'd like a quote in your soon as possible opening to get this mess sorted. From Luna? This is from me? Okay, so my lights uh, turn off randomly without me touching any of the switches. Also, if I leave my security camera light on too long, the breaker trips. Good to know. I'm super busy in the next few weeks, in the meantime, I'm just flicking the light switches on and off a few times to get them to turn on. There's probably a short wiring that has been causing the lights to turn off. For the camera light, limit your use to shorter bursts to avoid flipping the breaker. Okay. More power than you. Okay. The diagnosis above are just assumptions, and at this point, I can't give you a quote, unfortunately, without flip, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Randomly turn off and on the switches to turn them on. That makes sense, of course. And for the camera light, limit use to short bursts. Last night I thought I heard something outside my house, so I promptly checked my security cameras to see what it was and saw a strange man creeping around, unsure of what this person was doing snooping around outside. I shined the camera light on them to get a better look at who it was. After clearly being caught, he ran off, but after checking the footage, blah, 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 blah. Down on me after the fact that he matched the description of the man police were after for a murder. So our duty as members, blah, 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 blah. Everyone shares his message, monitor your cameras, and if available, use your camera lights to deter any suspicious persons away from your property. So it's like uh, Five Nights at Freddy. As of today, we've notified the agency about a potential suspect we believe is involved in a sex trafficking ring. Our suspicion uh, comes from the disappearance of a number of female victims. 
We know that the man operates alone and nice blah 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 blah. Uh, he is around six feet tall, bald, white, medium build, and has a forearm tattoo. We'd like to stress this message particularly to the women, as you could in fact be his next target. I am a woman, so I could be a target. Based on the track record, it seems as if he's looking to kidnap women exclusively. <laughs> I don't know why I read it. <laughs> it's also come to my attention that the builder who <laughs> developed. Um, many of the homes in this area cut some corners. Many of the many of the reports point to a compromised window locking mechanism as the culprit behind the unwanted entries. Security is key here. Leave your lights on. Ensure your windows are locked. How the fuck do I lock the window? I must lock all the windows. Faster? I mean, like, you think I'm choosing to walk? <laughs> yes, this is a a good speed for my playthrough. Okay, cool. I hate doors, dude. I really hate doors. The way she opens them, man, it makes me so pissed off. Nobody opens doors like that. Okay. All windows are locked. Are you sure? No. Cool. What next? I've done what you wanted. Let's start our day. As always, I open the report desk. I place it neatly next to my two, my, my rapist and my murderer. Suspects. And then I get social spy open. That's a, that's a bike. It's okay. My debit card, my upgrades. Sometimes I like to buy upgrades. The DMV. You don't need upgrades open. The SIM DB. The root kit. Records. Records? Is that the record? Okay. And, oh, set cams. Yo, am I supposed to... What? All right. There's no murderer. No sex trafficker. Sick. Done. Now what? I'm guessing someone's gonna call or something? You want my cam top right? Maybe that makes more sense. Maybe here? That could be nice. I watched some TV. Do I have any info about them? Yeah, maybe I can research them. They have no names, though. Name. I mean... <laughs> Yoink! Ugh, damn it. The internet went out again. But I'm not... I need to go reset the router in the backroom closet. Okay, so I think it's teaching me the game, guys. Backroom... Closet. The back room closet. Could that be in here? And then what? Which... I need to find the router, right? The back room closet. She said I have to find the router, right? This feels like the back room, to be honest. Could this be? Oh, that's the creepiest fucking. Okay, this is. Oh! 
I, I, I <laughs> It's gonna be <laughs> well, What the fuck am I supposed to do with this? What? I, I can't do anything Sorry, it was it was it was because it was dark. It scared me. I think it's on again. It's because it was dark, and then I turned on the flashlight, and that scared me because I thought were the lights even off before? Let me turn them back on. Oh, I hate that. I really hate that. There we go. I'm so sorry. <laughs> How's the volume, guys? The game volume. Should I turn it up a little? <laughs> I'm like a grandma, dude. Maybe down here, maybe. Maybe that's better, actually. Is it better down there? I I, I don't. Am I supposed to do something with the report desk? I feel like I could turn it up a touch. Hold on. I think I'm just supposed to wait at the moment. Oh! Suspicious... Okay. Uh, suspicious person report. Jeremy Bynes. Date, the 1st of June. Or the 6th of January, if you're a pleb. But uh, this is clearly the 6th. Ah. I go by the 6th of January. Why did I write, read it the other way around? You're a pleb if you'd call this the 1st of June. It's clearly this. Why did I disagree with myself insulting the other? What's wrong with me, dude? What, what kind of a fucking joke was that? I just go. Okay. It's the 6th of January. <laughs> Day first, then the month. Anyway. Uh, I woke up last- late last night from a bad dream. I decided to get some fresh air in the backyard, and I was outside for about 20 minutes before I heard a noise I had heard before, about two weeks before this, and three <laughs> weeks before that. I, I know it was the sound of digging, and it was coming from the direction of my neighbor's yard. He has a privacy fence, but I couldn't see much. Well, I don't see him speak to the man, but because he works night shifts, I know he does some gardening, but I just don't see him ever doing it any during the day much. Maybe that's what he's doing now, but no, it seems strange. The wind was blowing in my direction that night, and I- it had a foul stench to it. Suspect, Jeremy Bynes. So is Jeremy Bynes, is this a report? Real quick, guys. Is this a report from someone else and their neighbor is called Jeremy Bynes? That's what we're doing here, right? We're doing other people's reports that they send us. Fuck it, let's, uh, let's start with looking up Jeremy Bynes. Police report, Jeremy Bynes. At 19.20 hour, uh, at 7.20 on uh, June 11th, Jeremy Bynes and his girlfriend Jessica Steele were <laughs> reported missing from their friends and multiple members of their family. They had been missing for three days before a missing persons report was filed to the police. At about 8.40 on 8th of January, Mr. Sullivan, living at the Sunnyfields apartment complex, took out his trash uh, to the nearby trash bin and noticed some groaning and a hand coming from a pile of trash. Mr. Sullivan called the police right away. Jeremy Bynes had been missing for about six months and was a person in the trash bin. He was found delirious with multiple bruises and knife wounds to various parts of his uh, body. After intensive questioning with Jeremy, he seemed to have little recollection from the past six months. He had no idea on, it, on the whereabouts of Jessica Steele. Whatever was done to him in the past six months, it probably will leave lasting mental trauma for the rest of his life. Okay, Jeremy. Okay, so I have to drag stuff here, I think. Okay. Cool. So what? What is this? We... So she... 
What's the suspicious play? You heard him digging? So he's been digging a lot. Well, let's look up his debit, I guess. How are we gonna find from here what he, like, how are we supposed to solve this? Hey, yeah, it's probably bodies or something, but you know, this seems... Five results. He's been at a hardware shop, a fill and go gas stop, the garden emporium, the garden emporium, and family pharmacy. Cool. Cool. Oh, can I click them? Oh, thank you. I didn't know that. Okay, cool. Should I have that there? Clear that for now. I didn't know I can click them. That's my bad. Oh, here we go. Shovel, fertilizer, and hibiscus seeds. Oh yeah, here we go. Okay. Gas and peanut butter candy bar. That's not very suspicious. Cow manure. What? A potted palm tree? Disinfecting wipes, stain remover, some peen uh, some chewing gum, and trash bags. Tenaciously tough trash bags. <laughs> Yoink. Let's check my camera out for a sec. What? No, no. What? Did you hear that? That was knocking. Fucking leave! Why <laughs> the slow pan? Hello? I mean, like, what am I supposed to do? They could have spent a little bit of the intro saying, like, if anybody knocks, hide in the closet, <laughs> you know? I mean, am I not like a... What? Okay. Ah! Oh! I mean... <laughs> I was even trying to close it. Like, <laughs> I should check the rooms, yeah. Windows locked. I'm closed. Yikes. Stop closing! All right, we're good. <sighs> I really have no idea what I'm doing here. Uh, okay, let's check out. Okay, so clearly he's, I mean, what do I? Okay, so eye color. I don't know. His hair is brown. Why am I looking him up on the DMV? His hair is brown. His eye color... We don't know. He's male, though. We know that for sure. And his age... We don't know. Let's look him up. No internet connection. You're a fucking asshole. I hate, what the fuck is this emote? What the fuck is this? This is a te why do I keep seeing this emote? Mega lol, this is a terrifying emote. We got him now, boys. I hate seeing this in my chat. That is terrifying. Right, let's go fix the internet. <laughs> You're all doing it, it's good. Where's the internet, here? Yeah. 
I can't move, by the way, while this is going on. So that's great. Chat, what should we buy? <laughs> I mean, I don't have any money. How do I? Maybe records. Where is records? Have I opened records? That's police records, isn't it? Yeah, that's police records. I, I'm, I don't know what I'm supposed to do now. Oh, social spy. I haven't done that, have I? I missed that. Let's see here. This might lead to stuff. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to go through the info here. I think I think I need to What was the police record? Some sort of other name. Wasn't there a girlfriend who was missing? Jessica Steele. We we laughed at that. So Let's look up Jessica Steele. Ah, oh, you know what? I like this. No police record found. I like this. I can see the... No, no! Someone's here! Just save steel. It's just like a steel, right? Yeah. How about Jeremy Steel? No? Okay. Uh, Jessica Steele. Okay. Jessica Steele. Oh, SimDB. Did I look? Could not find an IMEI device with this name. Jeremy Fine. Okay, put that in the root kit. Let's crack. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Yeah, I, I, I'm gonna have to try that again. I am guessing it's on some sort of timer. We'll try it again. I'm sure you have to find something when you go through it. Uh, we're, we're learning here. We're learning here. While we wait for this to not say error... We check out the camps. Okay, we're good. I should get some rest. <laughs> what do you mean, like? 
What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I mean, like, I need to learn the fucking game. What? Are you <laughs> what? <laughs> there must be a how to play, right? Hold up. There must be a tutorial. <laughs> ah, it's even got an arrow here. That's good, dude. Okay, dude. Let's fucking learn this game. <laughs> Maria, thanks for the two years, friend. A man with one hand with a seven. Jacob Dahl with a four. Steve Okaniva with a four. Tempest W, Russ, Dominut, Cole Murray, Zap IQ. Welcome back, you guys. Tier two from Cole Murray. Thank you very much for the 16. Kira Sauce came in with a gifted sub as well. Much love to you. Rear Tax with a seven. Raz was taken. Big Boy Yates, Tommy Gun, Papa Joker. N. Musel, J. Crocker, The Maddest. Thank you guys for the resubs. Three bucks from Pudding Pudding. Did Flash write that monologue? Yeah, you would think, wouldn't you? <laughs> Happy 26 months for The Maddest. The nice Bomb with the 26 as well. Tier 2. Hope you and Alex are well. Thanks again for the unbeatable entertainment. You really are a blessing in these otherwise shitty times. Much love, stay you. Much love, Strice Bomb. Much love. Hope you're doing well as always. Captain Phoenix, 19 months and 13 months coming in with the 40. Much love, friend. Much love. Here we go, baby. So, what? Yoink! Yeah, we know all this. Reports are found in the report desk application. We're opening the. We should have seen this before we started the game. <laughs> this is. Putting the report desk app will show you three icons. Yeah. Shredder. Used to discard false reports by dragging and dropping the paper icon on top of the shredder icon. How do I know if it's a false report? Drag and drop onto your desktop to open the report. Facts. Used to file correct reports. ID and evidence must be attached to correctly process the report. After dragging the middle paper report icon onto your desktop, you will see a description and some details about the suspect. The height and weight fields are an estimation, and the actual figures can be above or below the estimated values. First step is to find the ID of the person in question. This is done by using the DMVDB app, okay? After opening the app, you will have to fill in the information you know from the report to find the ID of said person. Click search when finished, and a list of potential matches will be displayed. In this case, the name of the suspect, Dahlia Jones, is known, so we can click the name and an ID card will... The ID must be dragged and dropped onto the report. Yeah. The next step is to search through the various other apps to find information on the suspect and fill the evidence quota. Social Spy is used to check for all social media posts this person has made. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In case it doesn't have an so we can type in the name. After clicking search, uh, if the person you blah 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 blah, all posts can be dragged and dropped in the evidence. Debit, previous transactions, yeah. You can drag and drop the resume into evidence. Sim, the cell phone. After opening the app, you will need to type in the name. Blah 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 blah. Rootkit, blah blah blah. Once you click the search will pass, and then you need to find the correct frequency to unlock the phone. This is noted by a beep sound notification, and done by dragging the slider to the correct position on the line. The time at the top reaches zero before you correct the phone, you'll be kicked out of the hack, and the rootkit app will be placed on a cooldown. Okay, and then you drag... You drag... Okay, I kind of like this. This is cool. This is like... This is so like, um, Papers, Please, but like a horror version. Hey, so you could- every- everything can be evidence. If you're unable to find the evidence of a crime and believe that the report is false, you can shred the report instead. Just drag and drop the report icon to the left onto the shredder. Only link evidence to reports that are pertinent to what you found. Attaching evidence that is not related will cause the report to be rejected. From here, your goal is to meet the daily quota of reports submitted each day, as noted by the today's report quota icon on your toolbar. Report quota. Your daily quota of reports is reflected in this item. Reject the reports quota. Whether you submit reports correctly or incorrectly, they will add to your today's report quota. Reports that are incorrectly filed will add to your rejected reports quota. Okay. Okay. Bonus quotas. You get coins for doing extra ones. Go to bed early quota. Uh, okay, yeah. That's my network. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, wait, how much? Okay, we're at the bottom here. Uh, 
You get upgrades. Yeah, that's cool. Got it. I know how to play. Iwulu45. Much love, dude. Miss you, dude. Sorry, I haven't been on so much lately. Much love. We all have lives to live, right? Uh, connect with the 19. Alpha Stealth. Happy one year. And Explosive Toots. Thank you for the 28 months. Let's try again, man. Sorry about that. That was kind of hidden. I, I feel like that should be a bit more open together with new game or something. <laughs> Or just have it in the intro. Who goes into this game for the I first time? And, my computer and get the night started. Ha, you know, like everybody needs to see that shit. Oh, you just skipped the yeah. intro. I know. I already I played around. That email and check out those bolos. Okay, here we fucking go, guys. Report desk. Let's see what's up. Christopher Ruiz. He's male. He's got gray hair. Report. <clears throat> I have to close the windows. <laughs> it's fine. Let's do that real quick, and then we'll get to the report. I'm excited to solve my... First report. Is this really something you have to do every time you start the game? Lock all the fucking windows? Yeah, uh, we'll see how it plays out, but it feels very much like Papers, Please, but a very, very different vibe to it, right? I think we're good. I saw a dog that looked like it was in a terrible shape lying down in my neighbor's driveway. It was whimpering. I ran over to check on it, and Mr. Ruiz, the owner, came out to get the dog. It's the first I've ever spoken to the man. He was wearing sunshade, so I couldn't see his eyes. He told me the dog was on her last days and was taking her to the vet very soon. When he picked the dog up, Maggie, he called her. She seemed afraid of him. He assured me she's a very old rescue that's afraid of strangers. He has several dogs. I can see them playing in his backyard, and they seem happy. I'd like to take his word that I was the reason Maggie was skittish, but this poor animal seemed outright terrified to be touched by this man. Okay. Sounds like a false report, considering he has many other ones that are fine. But, let's look into this dude. Social spy. Christopher Ruiz. Let's copy that name. And while that loads, let's get the DMV DB. Here he is. Details, male, age, 55. Height, 5'8". Weight, he's 153. Get this written down before we look into him. Uh, this little guy's feeling down because his mother is about to pass away. She's probably only got a few days left. Amazing how dogs can sense these sort of things. He's looking for a good home. Let me know. Oh. These pups are in need of a good home right now. I have more than I can deal with right now. So if you're interested, please let me know and we'll set something up. I've been raising dogs my whole life. I love them. Breeding them, dog sitting, grooming, you name it. And I've probably had some experience when it comes to dogs. Look at some photos of a lot of my dogs from over the years. I love them all, but none of them compared to Luther. I still miss him. I just lost my best pal on the world, on the planet. He was always happy to see me, wagging his tail constantly. We had some good times, but I know nothing lasts forever. Going to miss you so much, Luther. I'm on to you. I'm on to you, Christopher. Okay, never mind. I had a theory. It didn't work out. He seems like a good guy. He seems like a good guy. But let's have an extra look here. Well, what's his hair color? 
gray. Eye color, blue. <laughs> Yoink! Okay, cool. I mean, this guy, this seems like a false report, right? Let me just look him up on the uh, records. And then, uh, as long as nothing's there, I think we're good. No police record found. Okay. Did I say invite search? Invite search! Um, I'm gonna shred it. Not gonna waste time with this. How do I shred it? Ah. Claire McNeil. Claire is a horse person. She likes them and goes to check on them every day. Recently, after her boyfriend broke up with them, with her, she stopped for one day. Her boyfriend was then declared missing. She has been acting extremely strange lately. And I suppose it's only a matter of time before the truth comes out. People have been saying she killed him, kidnapped him, all sorts of things. I hope you can find the truth and clear her name because I know Claire isn't a murderer. Okay. Claire McNeil. We'll start here. Yeah, we'll check the cams real quick. But I mean, I don't think anyone's going to pop up day one. Oh, we're good. Hit me with it, McNeil. What's your boyfriend's name? No results. Really? Interesting. No police record found. We have a lot of info here. Let's fill it up. Age 25 to 30. Yoink! Height 5'6. Weight 125. Eyes gray. Hair color brown. And she's female. I mean, she looks naughty. Alias none. I uh, don't think this is going anywhere, really. I mean, how do I? Where do I go from here? Let's uh, let's look into the debit DB. See what she's been buying. Horse food and some coconut oil conditioner, cleaner, makeup remover pads, pucker up plus lip balm. I think that this girl is clean, to be honest. Let's hack her. It's time to hack. We're in. <laughs> Text combos. Jeff. What the fuck did I do wrong? Hello? I need to clear my head for a few days. I'm sorry, but this isn't how I plan to spend my vacation. I want something relaxing, not a go, go, go type attitude. It gets exhausting, Claire. I just thought we could have some fun. It was just a little trip to go cliff jumping. I honestly had no idea you were afraid of heights. I've told you plenty of times before that I'm afraid of heights. Believe me, this isn't the only time they've pushed me. I just think that we have the right chemistry. Don't think, okay? You're fucking ditching me? Interesting. Jeff. Amy. Jeff just dumped me. Well, I'm really sorry. What happened? Well, I tried to plan this memorable vacation. And he just didn't want to be there with me, I guess. What did you do? Did you... He fucking cheat on you, Claire? Don't worry about it. The guy's probably not worth my time as well. It's just sad that he ditched me out of nowhere as soon as we got back. I think this is clean, right? This is clean. Jeff? Um, This is clean. I'm not going to waste my time on this. I got to get a... <laughs> I mean, there's no way that she killed him, right? Do I, can I... There's not, no evidence here that she killed him. He just said that he's gone and wants to clear. Can I find more? Pictures. It's a... There he is. 
There's Jeff. We got him. Search history. Weird rum. How to deal with a breakup. Boyfriend is missing. Cheap booze cruises. How safe is a booze cruise? Can you get seasick on a cruise ship? Yeah. Yeah. It was... Yeah, yeah. It's fake. It was the other way. Um... Yeah, yeah, let's close this. Shred it. Oh, fuck! What does this mean? One out of three on the... Why is that one out of three? That was one out of three before... Was my first one? Hello? Fuck, I should have hacked that first guy. I bet you had- he had pictures of his, like, like, dog fights or something. Damn it! I chose not to hack him because... I've got a quota. What? Hello? What's happening? I think I misclicked. We're good. Okay. Shit. We're not off. Alfred Taylor, it's no secret that Mr. Taylor's business is going down the gutter for several... It's 11 p.m. For several years, he's been drawing from his savings to keep the uh, place afloat. But there's been a rumor going around that if he's, fina that he's financing his live stream through criminal groups for whom he provides his shop as a hiding place. I don't know if that's true, but he's always been one to keep himself a secret about what he does in the local... I've had with a guy. Okay, Alfred Taylor. Let's get him... Let's get him going here. Let's start with police. Alfred Taylor. No police? Okay. Ugh, oh, oh, oh my fuck. Internet went out again. I need to go reset the router in the back room closet. <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, just fucking reset it. I'm running out of time, man. <laughs> Anyone know when I go to bed? What's my what's my sleep schedule? Okay, Alfred, ya fuck, here I come. No results, okay, that's great. So, uh, Sim. We're hacking him. We're in. Alfred, search history. Loan, how does social media work? Calculate property. Pictures. They all seem fine. He likes boating. Text combos. Robert. Robert, I really need $2,000. $2,000? Are you serious? I gave you 650 last week and 500 in the week before that. What are you going to do with all that money? I'm in deep shit, Robert. I took out a loan, and if I don't pay off by the end of the week, they're going to take the store from me. You've done enough at this place by now. Uh, you're giving it up, but it's no longer profitable. Just sell this shop and make a nice retirement for you and Claire. This place is my life. I've been doing it just because things aren't going well right now doesn't mean I can't get out of this shit. Just let me pay off the loan, and I swear you'll have the money back by the end of the year. Sometimes you have to start something new and get rid of all things. I don't know this place happy for everybody. Think about your child family for... But what will happen to me? This place is pretty much my reason for getting up early in the morning. We will find a solution for this. For the 35th, no new... I know what I'm talking about. I've been thinking. Maybe you're right. This place is nothing but trouble. Blah, 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 blah. Glad to hear you come to your senses. Carla. Alfred, it's the middle of the night. You're still not home? I'm terribly sorry, Carla. I still have work to do at the shop. I'll be home soon. I'm going to bed now, Alfred. Sleep tight, dear. I'll get to it soon. Okay, 30th. All on the 30th. Okay. Interesting. His business is going down the gutter. There's been a rumor going around that he's financing his live stream through criminal groups for whom he provides his shop as a hiding place. Uh, where can I go from here? What date is this? 
few days later. Yoink. While there's nothing there, he doesn't know how to use... Alfred Taylor. He doesn't use how to know how to use social media. Perhaps that's a... Okay, he's been whining and dining. Yoink. I don't get to see what he bought. Bacon, it looks like. Looks like chocolate, bouquet of flowers. No, his history's clean. Just says, how does social media work? Can I click these? No. Alfred Taylor. Or... No, I, I I think this is uh, something I haven't looked up. There's nothing here. I mean, what will a license show me? You know, what will a license show me? Problem is, guys, like, I'm running out of time here because I fucked up that first one. Does the license show aliases? Maybe it shows aliases. Um, male, 50 to 60. Uh, oh, no, no, no. Brown eyes, brown hair. Weight, unknown. Age, 50 to 60. Weight and height, unknown. Let's find this guy. Alfred Taylor, got him. What? Ah, alias none. Okay. Anything? <laughs> Yoink! His wife? Do I have his wife? I only have Carla. Carla Taylor! The guy who doesn't know how to use fucking social media, there's no way that he's like... I'm Carla Taylor. Nah, this guy's, uh, I'm going um, off of my hunch. Oof, we're good. Layla Morrison. My friend Mrs. Morrison has been acting kind of strange for the past few weeks. She won't come out and see her other friends or me anymore. She doesn't even tend the garden or anything else. When I went to make a surprise visit a few days ago, I heard her arguing with her husband. He left the house shortly afterward. Whenever I try to reach her, I think she deliberately ignores me. Could you follow up on that, please? I'm afraid something's wrong, especially since she seems to be buying a lot of alcohol lately. Layla Morrison. I've got to, I, I feel like I'm running out of time here. I still need one good report, I think, so. Oh no, we're good actually. This is my reports for the day, so fake ones count. Two out of two. Today's report quota, we're good. In that case, let's check out the house. So hard. All right, I gotta look at the cameras more often. I think let's let's try again here. Who the fuck is this? That's the sex trafficker. I should get to my computer and get the night started. All right, guys, mission is... No, please. Mission is to... Make it through day one. Maybe I left the window open.
You can't lock the door. Alright, that's done. Let's go find a murderer or something. No, you can't do anything with the door. Real quick, real quick. Oh, yeah. I need to read that email and check out those bolos. Okay, Mick Tompset. What kind of fucking name is that? At around 5.30 p.m., I went to drop off some stuff for Mick. I usually drop it off at the same time every week, but I was running 30 minutes late, and when he answered the door, the house reeked. It smelled like old lady perfume and lemon cleaner, but a trillion times more potent. He was acting way more jittery than usual, but he didn't seem too bothered that I was late. Dude, he's very punctual, so that was also a red flag. He just took his stuff and slammed the door in my face. On my way out, I found what looked like a bullet casing in the grass, but turned out to be the cap from a lipstick thing. It seemed weird since the guy isn't married, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a girlfriend. Mick Homset. We just picked up Butch from the vets. Ruthie and I have been cleaning the house since we dropped him off Monday morning. She even sewed him a new doggy bed. I haven't seen a pooch so sick before. I think I went through two bottles of cleaner just to get the stains out of the carpet. The doc got him some meds and special dog food for the next few months. Said Butch should be ready for the dog park in a couple more weeks. Ah, okay. Wait, so she... My new friend Ruthie? Who the fuck are you? Ruthie? Didn't you say he doesn't have a girlfriend? It seemed weird since the guy isn't married. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a girlfriend. She's made me laugh so hard the past few weeks. My new friend, Ruthie, who knew getting pulled over for a broken tail light would mean in merriment. Would end in merriment. I don't know how many times I've driven by this place and never went inside. Even if you don't drink like us, Steamers has the best Reuben I've ever tasted. Don't worry, Ruthie let me take her picture. I might be old, but I'm not that creepy. My New Year's resolution is to die happy. Life's too short to spend it alone, and I have room in my heart for more than myself. Today I'm a new friend. Say hello to Butch. Hmm. Okay. Let's hack this guy. Yeah, saying I'm not that creepy makes me think that you're creepy. Local pet adoption centers, hound dog, senior dating sites, how to meet people when you're over 60, men's grooming, tutorials, can dogs get food with vets, best carpet stain, remover. Yeah, wasn't that part of the story though? What did he say? Cleaning the house since we dropped him off Monday morning. Okay. Okay. Um, pictures. I mean, so far he seems clean, to be honest. Ruthie. Is this Mitch's cell? Mick. Yes, who's this? Officer Ruthie. I know it's a little unorthodox, but you told me to give you a call, and so I decided to text you instead. I don't know why I didn't call. It seems so silly, but I wanted to make sure you were getting that ta taillight fix. If you need any help, I am available. Maybe you'd like to get a bite to eat sometime. Miss Ruthie, are you flirting with an old man like me? Maybe. Don't give me a call. I promise I don't bite. Be honest, this guy seems clean. Got you. Okay. Let me just check. Um. Let me check. Uh, fucking there. Let me check. Uh, Age 60 to 70. Maybe he has an alias. Maybe he's killed uh, Ruthie. <laughs> Yoink! Gray hair, brown eyes. Male. 
His name Mick Thompson? No. Perhaps it's Mitch. What, was, what did you call him? Mitch. Would that, would that be alias then? I think he's fine, to be honest. Height's unknown, guys. Both height and weight is unknown. I think this guy's fine. Look at his social spy. I did. That, that's, that's this. This guy seems... There's no... Oh yeah, maybe on social media. I need to check that as well. Should look up her... I'll look up Ruthie as well. <clears throat> Hold on. Let me have a look here. Social media, age 68. Yes, 65 plus, 5'8 in height. Weight, 144. Ugh, damn it. A lot of the internet went out again. Skims. I need to go reset the router in the backroom closet. <sighs> All of it scares me, guys. Wait! There's a window open! I could hear crickets! You guys heard the crickets, right? N Do I always hear the crickets? I think it's okay. I think we're okay. Maybe... Maybe I check all the windows. We're good. And we're... Good. Fuck, I'm spending too much time on this guy, man. What's your girlfriend's name? Yoink. Ruthie. <laughs> Tom said, come on. They're married. Oh yeah, the DMV. Search. No results found. Male, 68. Five eight. Perhaps you do sixty five plus. Oh no, yeah. No, I think this guy is. Um, what do you mean the age is wrong? He's sixty eight. Sixty to sixty five plus. This guy's clean. Yeah, we're good. Coming back from getting a late night snack. I passed through the park on my way home. I had my... It's not the wrong age, guys. 65 plus is the highest you can go. 65 plus. Focus on what matters here. Unknown suspect. See a couple of guys hanging around at the picnic tables. Uh, I recognized one of them as a personal trainer from Fitness Planet. He turned around and made eye contact, so I waved. He came running up to me away from his friends in a hurry, so I asked if everything was alright. He got defensive and kept asking me why Yoink. anything would be wrong. His general demeanor made me more interested in whatever was going on over by the picnic tables. However, he kept moving in front of me like he was trying to give his buddies time to hide something. I was so, wasn't at the park, not sure of his attentions or what they were doing, but I had a strong feeling that something wasn't right. Wow, you know all his info? Age 25 to 35. You're six and your hair is brown. Your eye color is brown, you're male, and your weight is 215.
How the fuck am I? What? Maybe I have to add more age. Like his estimate could be wrong. Really overwhelming, man. <laughs> Check every room, but I've barely, I just sat down, man. Like, I, I mean, the height's gotta be a little off, right? No results found. How am I supposed to find anything here? I mean, I don't have a name. Let's try broadening the age a little bit. Weight seems a little too specific, actually. <gasps> Hoyt Powell! Gotcha! You look like a... Hoyt Powell. Chaz Powers 92. We're on to him. What? No! He's been to Dargit. Cannot see what this says. Some mango shit. I think cat. There's no way capital letters matter. Thank you. Let's get in on his phone. Ah! Okay. We're good. You don't think I should have both? Oh, shit. Fuck! Shit! Okay. Um. <laughs> gotcha. This doesn't look like you. This is a different guy. Age is different. Valentine's such an overrated holiday. Loser boyfriends try so hard for no reason because their girlfriend is already cheating on them. And if a chud, a stud tries hard to impress when his girlfriend thinks he did something wrong. Okay. <laughs> Yoink! Why are all the girls I date psycho? Spring break with the boys like the good old days. Okay. Are we good here? We're good here. We're not good there. Um, where the fuck do I go from here? I have to. I have to wait for the phone thing to. Ah! Okay. Let's have a look around. So I don't think anyone can be in if the windows are closed. So it's pretty easy for me to check everything. Ah! I mean, there's no point in checking the shower. I doubt he's just gonna be stand. Like, what's the point of me doing that? If he's standing there- hey, you have, Why does he like- <laughs> Like, why is it such a big action to- Okay. This is this game, dude. Gotcha. X combos. Ma'am. <laughs> Working the grill tonight. I'll be there around 6. D Rock. Hey, bro, I'm going to grab food at my pay. All right, we're good. Get some drinks for the girls. 
they keep bitching about having to drink beer. Just get the vodka soda thing. I know Leia likes mango one if you want to turn. Wait, what color are her eyes? Okay, Leia? Brown or hazel? Okay, Leia has brown eyes. Let's remember that. Chad, yo, you wake, bro? Haven't been able to sleep yet. Been working, if you know what I mean, right? So that's what I wanted to talk about. There's this girl, not a regular girl, but we were talking instead of taking, of taking her teeth. I found out she does what we do, and she does it to chicks, too. Like, also, she's legit thick as fuck, and she's interested in your collection. I guess she collects piercings when she's done with them, but I told her about your eyes. She got all hot. Your eyes? You told this random slut about our thing. Think with your fucking head, man. She does everything we do. Kills, disposes, and collects. I think she sells their organs, too, because she's flushed. <gasps> what? You think that's enough evidence? I don't think so. We need two evidence. How do I drag this to the evidence? Chat, how do I... Fuck it out! Can I drag Chad? There we go. Chad. Evidence. Uh, search history. Drugs like Qualudes. Can you over? Can you overdose on allergy medication? Homemade preservation. Why would someone have a double iris? Eyeball genetics. Eyeball color. Seasonal allergies. Do I have sinus polyps? Sinus infection. Oh, I could take these. Well, that's for his eye. I don't know what this means. Fuck it. Why the fuck are they? Fuck, dude. Are they looking for chicks with brown eyes? I'm running out of time here, man. Okay, uh, this new guy, Chaz Powers, age 26. Okay, so we were off, maybe. It's not that it's a different... Yeah, okay. I need... I mean, surely, do you guys think that's enough evidence? I need to get his ID. Wait, I got that already. There. I feel like that's it. What? I did it! Cool, let's check the house. I mean, they, they talked about fucking, like, <laughs> doing shit with organs and stuff, so... Oh my god, I thought that was in here. Windows are good. Sleep now? Can I choose to sleep? I don't think I can choose to sleep, guys. That would be cheating. <sighs> Tamara Melville. I'm really scared, man. Strange men are living in Tammy's house nowadays, and I only ever get a decent look at them late at night. Tattoos, weird hair, and tattered clothes. Frequently, the place has been changing from a quiet, God-loving home during the day to a blaring punk rock garage. I have a feeling that these men are taking advantage of Tammy squatting in her home and there's nothing she can do about it. It just doesn't add up why the place is nearly polar opposite people staying inside the same home. There's no way to... Uh... She played it off like it was something that I imagined. Okay, so she's old. Fuck. No internet connection. Don't be here. Don't, don't be here. You need to sleep? Guys, I cannot manually sleep. There's a whole thing that if I do enough cases, I can sleep early. That wouldn't be a thing if I could manually choose to sleep. Then what's that about if I can manually sleep? Let's try it.
I hate that! I'm gonna sleep. Yeah, I, I don't think I can manually sleep. Guy who said, yes, you can. How do I sleep? Well, not my bed. That's where I start the game. Does someone really... If, if, if you literally tell me you can sleep, yes, you can. Why are you talking out of your ass? Why? What is that? What is that? I'm playing a horror game. I've got enough to deal with here. Please. <laughs> Please don't come in with your fucking just... Surely if you say yes you can. What is that? I've... I'm checking the windows. I'm listening for sounds. I'm doing fucking cases about murderers. You telling me that I can go to sleep. Why are you messing with me? Why? Why? It's literally a thing that if I do all my extra bonus quotas, I get to sleep early. Now, Tamara Melville. Fucking Tamara, come on. Mattress Emporium. Why are these glitched, man? I this this means nothing to me. Ah, this one works. Okay. Okay, loggers. She's partying a lot. That's what we got from this. Uh, let's do this. Let's hack. We're in. Check the cams. So I don't think I have to check windows and stuff unless I hear something. That's my theory. I mean, cars and motorbikes go past quite often. I don't think that means anything, but I, I really don't know. Bubble stitch, baby blanket cross shape. Hello? Oh, I should probably check cams when that happens. It's my instinct to go check all the windows, but maybe they're in the camera. Oh! Ha ha! Oh, I got goosebumps. This damn power breaker. No! The breaker in the file room closet. What? Hello? Oh no. All the windows. <sighs> Night one completed. Night two. Quick one minute break. <sighs> Life's 27 months. Thank you very much, my friend. Sad Polo with a 37 months. Cold the Joker with a four. Much love, friend. OP Shadow with a one year. Happy one year. Uh, Lightning Spider, I'm Winds, GTA Dr. Travis, and Brumby. Thank you guys for subbing. Enjoy your stay, guys. Fantasy Gamer, 30 bucks. Thanks for all the laughters. I hope you don't get scared too much. Me too, man. <laughs> Thank you very much for the big $30 donation. Ah! Fluex, happy one year as well. Ibens with a 13. Jesus Thompson with a half year. Fat boy, 26 months. And Fox Drawed, four months. Happy late birthday. We actually share the same birthday, so I missed, missed out on the birthday stream. Hope it was great. You too, man. Belated happy birthday to you. Loving the content on Tio and more Tio. Keep it up. Thank you, friend. Hello, more Tio. I like that you can turn off jump scares. Because some people might just be into the whole crime thing, you know? 
That's an interesting game on Doink. its own. You think I have to check all the windows as soon as I wake up? Is that a thing? I mean, I've locked the windows. Surely that... But I mean, he got in somehow. Press the middle mouse button on the windows. I've tried that. Someone said that earlier, Yoink. that it opens the curtains, but it... Oh, you have to be very specific. I pressed it so much at one point. Oh my god, why is that a thing? That is so scary. Right, another day, more work. Andrew Disher. I went for a run the other day and saw Mr. Disher behind me. I said hi and moved on, but 20 minutes later, he was still following me. He was starting to freak me out, so I tried to ask him what he was doing, but he wouldn't answer me. Just kept pretending he couldn't hear me. It was bizarre. Andrew! Why are you being a creep? No results found. Ephener friend side effects, best runner's playlist, effects of bee sting allergy, best wireless ear. You come take me to the hospital, bee sting. I've been calling you for like half an hour for dinner, take your earphones out, headphones. What was that? <laughs> Yoink! Oh my god, dude. Why does darkness scare me so much? Ah! Oh, oh my god, the door pushed me. <laughs> just, let's just keep going. <sighs> right. Yeah. Um, there's a... Text about his earphones being in. He's got a picture of earphones. This is going in the shredder. We're good. One, one, one done. He he couldn't hear. Don Keenan. Uh, ever since Don's wife disappeared last year, he's been acting weird. In that situation, you expect someone to be upset, but he's almost comical about it. Did I just hear a beep? Like a ding. I hear him weeping loudly in the house as if he wants everyone to hear. Last week he put up this gaudy memorial shrine of his wife Emily in the middle of his lawn with fake flowers, candles, and tinsel. Pretty sure I saw a scantily dressed woman follow him into the house. Uh, I heard noises sound a lot like loud sex, but I can't be sure what he's been doing. It's gross and creepy, whatever is happening. Okay. I mean, this guy sounds like he's just going through a tough time after losing his fucking wife, but you know. Proper response to grief, how to act sad. 
Homemade knockout gas. Unknown. We know what you did. Did you get the insurance check yet? They have a longer grace period before the marker. Uh, I told you this. It'll be a couple more months. What? Can't believe you did all this and didn't check the direction. It's afraid I'll be fucking December before we go to Hawaii. Can I not do more evidence? I guess I'm done. I thought that maybe, like, you need good- more good evidence. What?! What?! But I can only do two evidence! What did I do wrong there? No identification card! It could have been so easy, and I didn't do it. Listen, I'm- I'm still a noob. I'm st- oh my god. <laughs> Can we, can we just, can we just chill for a little bit? Can we just, just give me a second, man, to just... Oh my lord, dude. My fucking foot. <sighs> can I... Do that? <laughs> At the end. I heard a creak in the house, and that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> oh, my lord. Just, let's just take a couple of minutes to just... What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? Just as you entered the menu, there was a door sound. That must have been him. Ah, fuck. Surely if there's a door sound, he's already in the house and I've lost. Surely that's too late. What was I supposed to do before that? Yoink! <sighs> but I, I'm, I feel like I'm checking the cameras so much. This is how I felt with Welcome to the Game. There's so many fucking things you have to be on. And when I finally got all the instructions from someone, I was like, what, how the fuck is someone supposed to figure all of that out? Uh, uh. <laughs> Can I just see this shit again? I just want it. <laughs> Wait. 
<laughs> really, I've never been so scared, like, of nothing in real life. You ain't that scared? <laughs> I literally, literally all I heard was a fucking <laughs> and I <laughs> What is wrong with me, dude? What the hell is wrong with me? What does no permadeath mean? What happens after the jump scare? I just get to keep playing? <laughs> yeah, I know the music's really loud. The, ga the game sounds good though, so I can't really do much about the music sound. Rump Shakers, thanks for the four months, man. Off into woods with a 35. Sloth gonna rage, Missouli, thank you both for subscribing. The Yellow Ghost with the 22 months. Best content creator ever, short story. I live in the US, can't get a job by the US, but got hired by a Swedish company here. It's a sign. Keep up the great work, man. Hell yeah. My god. Random Ads, thanks for the 26. And Nacho Business Apple with a nine bucks. I was curious to know what your favorite game of all time is, either recorded or not recorded. I'd love to know. I've got a few. Call of Duty Modern Warfare is up there. COD 4. COD 4 from like 2008. Played that game a lot. Let's try again, man. Let's try again. I should get to my computer and get the night started. Can you read my sub? Real scrawly? <clears throat> You're not here. Um, happens every once in a while that someone's sub doesn't show. What did you, uh, what did you say? Chat, we're gonna work on this together, okay? As soon as you hear a sound, this can't go wrong. As soon as you hear a sound, if you hear any sort of sound, you're all gonna spam it to me. Not if the car comes, but if you hear like a dunce, tell me, okay? But stream delay? There's a three second delay. If you hear the door opening... Oh, this could go wrong, actually. Never mind. Don't, don't do this. <laughs> You're just gonna creep me out. Never mind. Never mind, guys. Oh. Yeah. I need to read that email and check out those bolos. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Is this gonna make me really paranoid? Went for a run the other day and saw a dish behind me. Oh, perfect. This... Is... False. Let's move on. Layla Morrison. My friend Mrs. has been acting kinda strange for the past few weeks. She won't come out and see her other friends or me anymore. Doesn't even tend the garden or anything else. When I went to make a surprise visit a few days ago, I heard her arguing with her husband. We left the house shortly thereafter. Whenever I try to reach her, I think she deliberately ignores me. Could you follow up on that, please? I'm afraid something's wrong, especially since she seems to be buying a lot of alcohol lately. <laughs> Yoink! Oh my god, dude! A Kayla Stormbringer? 20 gifted subs. Ya yeah, boy. Thank you so much, man. Welcome to the 20 new subs. Enjoy your stay, everyone. Let's get some hype in the chat for your boy. Akela Stormringer. Still going strong. Fucking hell, man.
<laughs> Yoink! Another 20 gifted subs? What the f ah! What? 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 What is it? What is it? What? What does that mean? Yoink! It was supposed to be 40 originally, so I would have be at 600 donated. Much love, though. Fuck me, dude. Thank you so much, Achilles. You fucking beast. You're fucking insane. Oh, error. Did I click this and just ignore it? I must have. Uh, thank you very much, man. Thank you, thank you. Why, why? Oh, yeah, to hit, uh, yeah. That, that's an insane amount, dude. There's some really fucking insane people in this community. Like, uh, insanely generous. Blonde and blue. <laughs> Yoink! <laughs> I'm in. Wine stores in the area, lawyers in the area, breakup songs, how to get someone back, how much you're allowed to drink and drive, how to catch a man streaming, uh, cheating. <laughs> you're, you're how to catch a man streaming. Okay, so she got, uh, ah, yeah, no, that's fine, that's fine. That's a really delayed reaction to backing out. Um, she's been broken up with. We're good, let's do this. Uh, have we heard anything? We haven't heard anything. How to catch your man streaming. <laughs> yeah, I think I think we're good. My ex-wife is refusing to respect the terms of my restraining order. I've seen her standing on the sidewalk outside my apartment for out of five nights in the past week. I told her to leave me alone over the phone. Today she left me a photo of me in my car inside my mailbox. Emily! Linton! Hello, Emily. I just can't get you out of my head, feeling really bittersweet right now. Okay, so she's been stalking him, basically. She found out where she, he lived. My favorite bar might get shut down. Been sober for eight years now, never touching it again. I've started a petition, keep blah, blah, blah. Throwing a nice lunch. There's a guy on the new season of there who looks just like my ex. Got me really thinking about him. Is that weird? Okay. I should honestly, why haven't I been checking records, dude? What is wrong with me? I haven't checked that in so long now that I think about it. Emily Linter, responding to a domestic disturbance reported by Farad Joseph Scott. According to Mr. Scott, spouse Emily uh, Linder began threatening Mr. Scott with violence during a heated argument. When we arrived, the couple had moved outside the residence. Okay, so he fucked that that's why she fucked him up and that's why um there's a restraining order. Um What am I supposed to do here? Like what am I looking for? <clears throat> Evidence of something Yoink. worse than stalking? Hold on, did I just... Fuck! Dad! Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. Uh... 
Um, she's female. She's brown and brown. She has... Her height is 5. And her weight is 145. Lovely. And her age is a nice 25 to 30. Five one, so let's do that. You getting married, Achilles? Who are you marrying? Mr. Clark? Can you marry us? You are now married. Mr. Clark, Achilles Stormbringer. I, we are gathered here on Twitch from all over the world um, to do stuff. Well, what are we doing here? We're playing games, but we're also marrying two complete strangers. Um, do they know each other? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I came in the middle of their conversation as they asked me to marry them. Uh, welcome to marriage. I very often say never get married, guys, but that is one of the many jokes you get to tell when you get married. So it's one of the many perks of getting married, I'd say. So have a good time being married. And uh, now you can kiss. Ferris Scott boyfriend, Ferris Scott girlfriend, Ferris Scott wife. Ferris Scott. Oh, uh, that's... Okay, so that's... Okay, so... How to be in block... What time zone is now? <laughs> Do frogs get high if they lick each other? I'm not seeing any evidence here that, um... There's a crime going on. Yoink! Oh, that scared me. I thought it was a baby. Ah! <laughs> Fucking... Ah! Every time this damn door, dude! <sighs> so I... <sighs> Stalking is a crime. All right, fuck it. I'll put in. But is it stalking that she's searched if he has a boyfriend? Like, chat. What am I doing here? I'm stressed by time. I mean, like, where's her fucking phone? Here we go. Text combos. Dad. I'm tempted to drink again. David. Work. What's she been buying? What have you been buying? What are, you, what are you even buying? <sighs> she drinking again? She's... No, she's not. <laughs> Yoink! I, I think we're fine. What does that say? Motels... What about Farah? Ugh, damn it. Oh my. The internet went out. Uh, I need to okay. put the router in the back room closet. Um, she has a restraining order, Teo. Oh, that's true. Or he has one. Well, she has one on her from him. Yeah, okay, we'll, uh, okay, we'll put in the searches. That's part of the restraining order, isn't it? Part of the restraining order is, uh, oh, I got it lagged. Ah! Ah! Okay, part of the restraining order is, like, don't look up shit about the person you have a restraining order. You just, be, uh, you know? 
I'm gonna have a heart attack, dude. I'm gonna have a heart attack. Check out the cameras. Where are you, creeps? You okay? No. No, I'm not. Swear I heard something. Check the cams if you hear something. Okay. Okay. Got you. I heard you. Why is he coming like... Does that mean I win? Or will he pop up on this one now? This is the same camera from a different angle. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, um, search history, how do I find her, oh no I had her here, uh, Stalking. I got you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Was the light switch? He moved the light switch. The uh, no. was there before. <laughs> you never know what this game will do to you. God. I, um... These kind of games, man. Like, you watched me play Welcome to the Game. I fucking... I... I it's, it's absolutely terrifying. Six. Set that to six. Weight one fifty five. Set that to one seventy five. Brown brown. Fifty to sixty. Bedroom window apparently. What? What? Ah! Okay, we're good. <laughs> I really hate backing out of the computer. <laughs> Yoink! No, oh, we're good. We're good. <laughs> fuck was that sound? It's like the fridge or something, right? But you never know with this game. You hear that? Did you hear that? You heard that, right? Yo, nothing's on the cameras! Nothing's on the cameras! Am I supposed to check the windows? What? 
You said check the cameras when there's a sound. This damn power breaker. Oh no. We're in the file room closet. I really, really hate this. Got you! Got you! Got you! Was he in the window? He was in the window when you stood. What? Uh, no. Hello? Hello? What the fuck is that? <laughs> I swear I heard. Tuk, 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 tuk. Ah! There was an owl, but before that, was that me sitting down? Maybe that was me sitting down. When am I supposed to check my windows? <laughs> Yoink! <laughs> Here, you guys have to hear this with me. There you go. What am I doing? I've forgotten. Here, Norma Metzger. Got her. Came out! <laughs> Yoink! Hello, everyone. I can't wait to see my grandchildren soon. My house is almost presentable. Sincerely. Norma. <laughs> Yoink! What was that? What was that? What was that sound? It was like a boing. Is that the internet going out? The internet's dead. I have to fix the internet. Hello! <laughs> yeah!
Yes, I've come to fix the internet. <laughs> the door, the door, do it, dude. Fucking asshole. <laughs> Okay, I bet you if you hear a click, that means that a window's unlocked. Doesn't make much sense, but, you know. Yes! Yoink! Night two. I have to do all the windows. Lost my pants! Five gifted subs! And a sixth Yoink. one, my man. Let's do this first. Th thank you to the subs that have come in. I'm busy shitting myself right now. I will read it in a... Read them once I inevitably cry. Fail and cry. Okay, we're ready to work. How's the house coming along? Any shy lighting machine? Not 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 quite yet. I, I bought a juicer first. As are apples. Why? I bought a juicer first. As our apples are in season. We got a lot of them coming. <sighs> it's on our list of things to buy though. I'm very excited about it. There was a plane. Has he arrived by parachute? Once the winter comes, I'm very much getting a chai latte machine. That'll be lovely, lovely weather for that that bad boy. I um, yeah, slowly getting there. Uh, what am I doing? Okay, Alan parked in front of Murphy's Medical Research and Free. You guys are being fucking insane. I, I need to focus on the game. Um, I will read you all as soon as you watch the staff leave for a moment and then seem to call a technician over to his vehicle. Two spoke briefly before the ma man walked away to his Yoink. own car, looking a little uncomfortable. As he walked away, Alan smashed an unlabeled bottle of liquid on the ground, shouted at the technician about expensive ingredients, then pulled out and sped away from the clinic very quickly and most definitely over the speed limit. Yoink. Okay, and we're looking into him. Interesting. 
What the fuck? What is going on in chat right Yoink. now? Okay, hold on. I got to I uh, uh wow, Alan Nowick. Um I I I have too many things in my head right now. What the fuck is happening here? What is this? Yoink. What are, what is what is this? What are all what why where did all of this come from? <laughs> What the actual fuck? Uh, chat, I'll let you guys hype it up for a bit. Let me, uh, I'm, I'm inevitably gonna lose here real quick. I, I, it's, it's coming, we all know the scare is coming. And then, um, I will read properly what's just come in from everyone. Especially lost my pants. What the fuck is that? That's 50 gifted subs. And, and there's a whole lot more from there. So thank you. Um, I will, I will, yeah, you guys hype it up for a bit. Then, you know, let me just... I'm so anxious, I need to just keep going for a little while, um, but you guys are fucking Yoink. beasts. Holy shit. I'm just gonna let you do your thing for a little bit. Adam parked in front of Murphy's medical research. Yeah, yeah, we know that. Uh, Alan Noah. Well, y'all, I guess all good things come to an end. After five years Yoink. of living the Tokyo dream, I'm moving back home. I'll never forget the amazing experiences and memories I made living in this beautiful country. Yo, this is not... This is back in 2019, so he moved back. So he moved to Japan, then, and he was having the time of his life, and he moved back here, I'm guessing America, and now lost his job, right? Is it something like that? Yoink! I don't see any evidence of a crime, though. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, chat. Let's, uh, let's keep looking. Let's look into his... ...records. Early on the morning of August 14th, 2011, Noah's car was found pulled over on a country road. Uh, the windows were fogged up and the car's interior lights were on. Inside the car was Nowak and Lisa Masson. Masson appeared to be heavily intoxicated in a state of par partial undress. When questioned, Nowak became defensive and aggressive. Man insisted that he was friends with Masson and was simply giving her a ride home from a party where she was given alcohol by crowd. Masson admitted that it was Nowak who had purchased vodka for her and insisted she drink it while on a late night drive. Masson would provide no further details. Lisa Masson. How are you not freaking out about the subtrain? I literally... I will. But it's tough for me to do it all at, the, uh, at this moment. Yeah! <laughs> That's why I'm asking you guys to carry the hype just a little bit. Four hundred and thirty-eight percent hype train. What the fuck? Okay, guys. I'm actually terrified right now. I'm 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 sorry. I'm just. Uh, what do we? Uh, okay. I mean, Lisa Masson didn't. Was that an owl? What was that? <laughs> Yoink! God, guys. <laughs> Yoink! Yeah, okay, let's check your name. Let, yeah, let's check your... Ooh, let's check Lisa's phone. Nothing. I mean, it's 2011, Yoink. what's that gonna have to do with anything? Yoink. Yoink. Holy shit balls. Yoink. 
<laughs> Yoink! <laughs> I can't do this, dude. I can't do this. We're just gonna take a minute's break, because I'm sitting here really focused in a horror game. Meanwhile, chat's fucking on fire. You know, so just can we, let's just take a quick one minute break. Or, or three. Uh, well, like 130 subs came in during that hype train. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Honestly. First, a Kalis with 40 here. Yoink. Lots of resubs. I lost my pants. Five. Then 50. Because why the fuck not? Oh my god. Okay. Um, I lost my pants. 56 gifted Yoink. subs is what I count here. What the hell? Lil War with 10, 20, 30, 40 gifted subs? Yoink. Thank you guys, thank you very much. Nick Rick with a five. Joel's Pep with a five. Jaycott, ten gifted subs. Is that a ten is that ten thousand bits? Ten thousand bits from I Lost My Pants. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. 100 bucks or something like that, right? Thank you very much, man. Thank you. Much love. Much love. Much love. Much, much love. Yoink. Crown Red Air, Randall Bolts, Zewoos, Greater Jeans, Flubly. Thank you guys for the resubs. Harry Ballsack. <laughs> Evasive Milk. Thank you for gift gifted. Candy Mane, the Monster, point. Alec Milo, Urn Dog. Proud to be sub for this long. Hell yeah. Frogger, Banana Butt, Zimpax, Firestorm Ace, Seijo Kid. Thank you guys for the resubs. Frankenstein with a sub. Shaheel, 33 sub. The 45 guy with a three. Hooligan, Hooligan. So many new subs coming in here. D Demo is me. Trimer Turner. Thank you guys for the subs. Nick Bass, Sixil Husky. Welcome, guys. Welcome. L Sky with a seven. Ben Go Innovation. Thank you guys for the resubs. Much love and for many good times ahead. Much love, much love. Love that you got a house. Me too. It's really scary when I'm playing this game. But yeah, I'm, I'm really happy about the house as well, man. Commander Cody with a gifted sub. Candyman with a three gifted sub. Ben Go with a came in with one as well. Husky came in with one. Ben Go with another. Thank you guys. 500 bits from Frankenstein and 300 from Wenderstorm. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tio, you rock. Much love. I don't know where this came from. Fucking scam trains. Ah. Little Cheese, Cheb Master, Jack of Spades, Tank Slayer, and Dur Dave. Thank you guys so much for the support. Thank you everyone so fucking much. A special shout out to Lil War. A special shout out to Kayla Stormbringer. And a special shout out to I Lost My Pants. And, and the rest of you, you guys are insane. Jay Cot came in with 10 as well. Nick Rick came in with some. I, you guys are incredible. Um, thank you everyone. That was some hype train. That was some hype train. Why do you guys keep saying that the guy is in the trees? He's not in the trees. You say that and then I look in the trees and he's not there and you're freaking me out. Stop saying check the trees. He's not there, okay? If he's in the trees, then I apologize, but I've checked every time. He's not in the trees. Oh, I remember reading that, Scrawly. I remember reacting to you look sexy, as sexy as a freshly caught salmon. I thought that was funny. And I answered about uh, Super Seducer, didn't I? Maybe I read it and forgot to answer, actually. Um, Super Seducer, I've been talking about playing that with Alex for quite some time now, to be honest. One day. One day. It's not exactly a new game, so... I'm sure I'll... Um, get to it looks hilarious, so... You're gonna cry when he's actually in the trees? Yeah. That's just... Bah! Okay. We're clear here. So. Let's just chill for a bit. Check the trees real quick. No one there. No one there. 
No one there. What was that sound? Perfect. The internet is disconnected. We're good. There's no one here. Okay, who's fucking with me? Restart the router. Okay, I need to do uh, three things and it's already 11 p.m. Um, look at this. Still getting the salts for us. That right there is evidence of a crime. Mallory. Wait, what? You Got you your parafoam hair drive fresh off the dehydrator. I'm outside the clinic now. See you soon. Zach was looking. I got all paranoid. I'm sorry. I lied when I told him where I was getting my materials from. She's a drug dealer. I have the methanol you asked for. Meet me at your chosen location. Yeah, yeah let's just get her ID. And then, uh... He, he's a drug dealer, I should say. Fridge, you saw him? In the fridge. Okay. Male, 31 years. Okay, chat, you guys always say check the cameras, but he's not in the cameras. Chat, you always say check the cameras when there's a sound. You say like, no, don't go check the cameras. There's no one in the cameras. <laughs> What am I supposed to do with that? If there's no one in the cams, then you are good. Are you sure? Stop saying he's in the fridge. Why would I all of a sudden believe he's in the fridge? If it hasn't worked this far. Come with a new joke. We're running out of time. I'm still on the first one. Did I get his ID? Fuck are you? There. Boom. 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 Fax it. He's a drug dealer. He did it again. He stole someone's package. This time it was the house across the street. He just came up to the front porch and took a box. I swear it's probably that young man who lives down the road. This needs to stop happening. Male. Brown. Green. 
160. 5, 6. Let's do 6. And age 20 to 30. Let's do 15 to 30. And then let's take the calves. Are you are you amusing yourselves here? I mean, you're not amu like there's like a thousand different places you guys are giving in chat. I'm not going to look at one of them and be like, "Oh, well I guess he's in the shower." Magnus, I got you now. Magnus looks fun. I am so stressed out. No results found. Alias? None. Go sub mode if chat is too crazy. Mods. They're being a little too wild. <laughs> I'm on to you. Search history. Fermentation process. Best is one. Raw food. Getting friends. <laughs> I mean, this guy doesn't seem that bad. This guy's like suspiciously into food. Like there's a suspicious amount of food interest. You know? Oh my god, what is that dramatic fucking way to open? Nobody opens doors like that. Combo said they don't serve human. Wait, I gotta have a look again. <laughs> I miss that they're fucking cannibals. Yoink! I don't think, like I said, I don't actually serve, I don't, and like I said, they don't actually serve human. I think the eyes were some type of gelatin or other animal eye. I don't know what the fingers were, though. I just know they were some type of animal. What the fuck? Besides, I've been dying to try this buried meat you've been cooking up. Basically just rots for months, it's delicious. Yoink. All right, my foreign friend, I'll save room in my stomach.
What? Is this evidence? That's the ev- is that all I'm looking for? Just have to take a break before I think. Sure, I mean, I've got two out of two, so if he's a cannibal, he's a cannibal. Fuck it. It was wrong. He's not a cannibal. That seemed so... What? <laughs> it had nothing to do with the report. Am I missing something? <laughs> it was wrong. I put the an I put the ID in. Reported for stealing packages, charging him for cannibalism. But why the fuck is he like, oh, I don't think it was human. Are they just joking? He literally was a suspect for stealing packages? That doesn't matter, I found that he's a cannibal. <laughs> what? I don't- I don't understand. I must have missed something on that. That must have been a joke. That was a really you weird wait. conversation. Oh my god, it wasn't the right guy. It wasn't the right guy. There was no name, I only had a description to go by. I looked up through the description, found a name, and looked up that guy's phone. I found a cannibal. It wasn't the guy we were looking for. We were looking for the guy stealing from Postal. Like some neighbor's post. I just found a random cannibal, so that's great. And, uh... We're running out of time. We only need one more on my quota. Come on, let's speedrun this! Quick check on the cams. Nothing? Nothing? Nothing. Jeremy Bynes. I woke up last night from a bad dream and decided to get some fresh air in the backyard and I was outside for about 20 minutes before I heard I heard before, about two before this and three years before. Okay, it's a guy, the, the guy who dig, he digs. He digs, he digs. Was this guy, was he? Fuck, was he? Was he? I need to find evidence on him. Fuck, what did we do with this guy? I can't remember. We- this is the first guy we got. I don't think we even finished this guy. How to plaster wrap large items. Evidence. How to find a person. Best way to remove friends. Uh, stains. How to deal with loss. Is vengeance worth it? That's my evidence. I've got him. Jessica, that's who you killed. I will find him. I swear to you, I will find him. No matter how many it takes, I will find him. He'll pay for what he did to you and me. Love you. Oh, she died by him, and he killed him. She died by whoever... Yeah, look at that message gone. So it was a revenge. It said his vengeance worth it. We got him, we got him. Let's get the identification. Fuck! How do I get your... Male and brown hair. Oh, God. Did it say how to hide multiple bodies? I have no time for this. Male and brown hair. The fuck was that? I saw you! Yo, I saw you! What do I do now, chat? Chat, I lost him! I'm running out of time!
I have no time for this! For the window! That, there's no time! I'm gonna lose! Brown hair, and he's male. What's his name? Jeremy. Got him. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Clutch! No! Why is it bad? It still counts. It still counts. Why is it bad? But the rejected reports! I, it still counts for some reason. What? Can I just hit my quota by failing? The evidence wasn't added? I had two out of two! Can I remove evidence? Oh my god, can I remove evidence? I've never tried to remove evidence. I can remove evidence, can't I? I should have- I should have removed it and put the better evidence. <laughs> I've never tried to remove evidence. That's what I should have done. I should have- I'm hysteric. Can the night end? I pre- <laughs> I right clicked by accident. I right clicked by accident. <laughs> Genedy Ignatiev. I heard the most frightening noise yesterday evening. It wasn't the cats fighting or the raccoon rumble that occasionally happens in the neighborhood. It was so too early uh, for that. But it was undoubtedly some animals. I swear I hear breathing. Half an hour following the silence, I heard my neighbor's garbage cans get knocked over, prompting me to take a peek. I caught my neighbor, G, in a dirty apron, dumping some kind of dark liquid into his garbage cans. Genity... Ignatiev. Fuck. Yes! Night three. My father had. Let's do some upgrades, shall we? We're gonna upgrade. Let's take a breather and then we're gonna look at upgrades and we're gonna try hard this. Aodyne, 15 bucks. Just recently bought my Corsair RGP wireless SE gaming headset over at Corsair.com and I forgot to use code TO for 10% off, so here's your cut of the money. I don't think it works that way, Aodyne. But either way, I thank you for the $15, man. Hell yeah. Enjoy that Corsair Virtuoso wireless gaming headset. Antling with the three bucks? Tio, he's in your foreskin, dude. I mean, he may, he may as well be. He may as well be. I'm freaking out here. Notch Tiger Galler with five months. I really enjoy your streams at the moment. Good to hear it, man. Thank you. Ponomo with the five. Ethelidon, Unkept Hail. Snaky Dragon. What the hell is this game? Thank you guys for the resubs. This game is hell. This game is hell. Thank you for the 40 months, Snakey Dragon. Waver, Crestfall, thank you both for subbing. Pylord with the four months. For some reason, I didn't get my Twitch Prime sub for a couple of months, but at least it's good now. Well, welcome back, man. Biotic with the 13. Have your stream running, muting and unmuting it every time I die in this Rainbow Six Bank game. Kind of distracting, but we're winning anyways. Hell yeah, keep it up, man. Gookitak, thanks for subbing as well. Enjoy your stay. Somebody kill me. Am I too stressed? Like this, I find these kind of games this stressful. I find these kind of games so difficult to play because it's so terrifying that at any point someone can be there. <sighs> You're way too stressed. Yeah, I, I, I'm not doing great.
Captain Swassy, thanks for subbing. Enjoy your stay. Um, right, let me stretch. Let me stretch. Heart monitor? No, you don't want to see the heart monitor right now. Take a deep breath and close your eyes for a sec. This helps to calm down. God, Daddy Tio, read my message. Love all the content, especially the horror games. Keep up the good work and much love from the UK. Much love, Antling. Thanks for the $3. That guy with the 19 as well. Yeah, the heart monitor, man. That, that, that That's next level when I do that. <laughs> I don't think I could do that on this. Why the weird voice for him? Uh, because he said, oh my god, Daddy Tio, to start it. A voice actor bully, really? <laughs> you forgot a room? Did I really? If you're fucking with me, you're just wasting my time here. You better not be fucking with me. No, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't forget a room. Shower room doesn't have any windows. We're good on shower room. Okay guys, I have two out of three on rejected reports. From here on out, it has to be spotless. P Claire McNeil. You know what I think would make this game less stressful? If you could have the cameras in windowed mode. Let's get some upgrades to start with. Instant social search. Instant debit search. Instant police search. Instant IMEI search. Instant rootkit crack. How much points do we have? We have 20. We can do one of those. Which one do we want instant? Which one is quick? Which one do we always use? I would almost say the ID. Was there an ID one? DMV. Debit police. No, there's no there's no for DMV. I guess social. I guess social then. Not rootkick. I still have to hack with the root uh, kit. It, it doesn't change much. I'm going to do social. Where am I? No, you know what? I'm gonna do the phone one. The social one's easy. I just copy paste the name. Whereas the phone one, I do the name, then I copy paste the code and put it, uh, yeah. But that's not, that's rootkick. What, what is I-M-E-I? What is I-M-E-I, guys? IMEI? The code for rooting. Okay, perfect. I'm getting that. Owned. Nice. So 
So now if I open this, it just has it. That's nice. I like that. I haven't even read about her yet. Oh, it's the horse person. What did we do with the horse person? What? What? This isn't even the same person. Is this supposed to work? Oh, I don't trust this automatic thing. Who the fuck is that? Yeah. Is that the alias, do you think? Uh, she likes them and goes to check on them every day recently. After her boyfriend broke up with her, she stopped for one day. Her boyfriend was then declared missing. What the fuck is that sound? Illegal to slaughter your own chicken in America. How to slaughter a chicken? Russian food market near me. Russian chicken recipe. Who the fuck is this guy? Where's the horses? Maya. I thought the chicken was the test. I can't believe you slaughtered your own chicken. Just want to get off on the right foot with your parents. Who the fuck are these guys? But this is Claire. This is Maya. I don't think... I think this is... I, I, this is just awful timing. It's all supposed to be automatic. I think this is from last night. Chat, am I really supposed to... Are you, are you fucking with me? Are you fucking with me? Am I really supposed to check the cameras when someone knocks? There's no way I'm supposed to check. I. I've tried moving the cams. Uh, I don't think you can. Ah! No way to move the cams. Okay. What did I find her? Number. Men jag orkar inte! Brown hair. 
Fair. Okay, I got clear. Okay, cool. No, I just wait, don't I? Let's check out. One wrong and you lose? I know, that's why I'm going through everything here. Fucking give me the root kit! <laughs> Please. Horse food. Deep cleaner. What? What is it we think she's done? She's being strange? They think that she killed her boyfriend. I can't get into her account! <laughs> no, 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 why is it so specific?! There's not enough time! I, I'm, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, here. Watch me die right now. Ah. May as well check the house while we wait for that stupid ass phone to- Hello? You fucking in here? I don't give a shit if you are. Come on then. Breather. Still an error. We may as well check the cams. It's all good. Very nice. All of this because of the automatic thing, and we got some random dude. Watch this be- watch it be correct. Watch it be correct. There's barely enough time to do that shit. Holy crap. I'm in. Oh my god, you turned off the internet, didn't you? Yeah. Come on, then. The automatic only makes it instant when you input the name of search. But then that's useless. But it didn't work. I thought it was that, so I opened up the thing to put in the thing, get the thing, and it already had a code there. I don't really know how it works. Okay, text combos. Jeff, what the fuck did I do wrong? Hello, I need to clear my head. Oh, this one's innocent. I told you plainly before that I'm afraid of heights. Believe me, this isn't the only thing that pushed me to make the decision. I just don't think we have the right chemistry to be. The fuck was that sound? I need to clear my head for a few days. She's innocent. Unless she... Just dumped me. I think, I think this one is innocent. This one's innocent. If, if it, I remember doing this, and I remember reading that and thinking she's innocent. Yeah, we're good. <sighs> I was outside watching my son jump on the trampoline in our backyard. I'm 
happening. I saw someone parking, peeking at him through a slit in our fence. I wanted to confront whoever, but when I got around the other side, there was no one there. I checked in with our neighbor thinking it was him, but he said he didn't see anything. Yeah, I even went and checked the surveillance camera, but later said he didn't catch anything. I know I'm not crazy. I saw what I saw. How the fuck do you have all this description of someone you saw through a fence? Hair, black. Eye color, gray. I got you. I see you. I see you. I see you! I see you! Male, black, gray, black hair, height six. Weight, 145. <laughs> 30 to 40. Carter Bale. Could it be this guy? Let's see if he's a pedo. So do you think? 74. Let's find out if that's him. That's the old one, isn't it? 34. Yeah. <clears throat> Damn it! Oh, I forgot. I forgot which one it was. I I, could, I had two ones, and I was like, "Well, it's this one." That okay, let's let's keep going. Carter Bale records. It's fine. We got plenty of other things. Carter. What is Carter? Carter. <laughs> I forgot which sound it was I was listening for. Oh, of course you're nowhere. Of course you're nowhere. What did you buy? What did you buy? Safety work 100 pack cable ties. That's a little weird. That's something that's that's weird. Binoculars? This is weird. A saw? Can't see what this one says. Which one's the binoculars? Top one. Top one, yeah? Yeah. That's evidence. You hear that? Is there someone in here? Because he's not in the camera. What? He's in here. He's in here. Oh no, I don't want to... I, I don't want to click right click. I don't want to click right click. I don't... Can we not click right click? Can we just please keep playing the game? This isn't good. This isn't good. You know there are two killers, right? One doesn't show up on cameras. I had some genius in chat who said whenever there's a sound, always look at the cameras. I, 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 I. Am I supposed to chat? Am I supposed to check that they're locked? Because I'd hate that. That takes so. Ah, why? I mean, that takes so much time. I've already locked them, right? Like, I feel like once that one was unlocked after we had locked it. But th there's not enough time, dude, like...
Is this the right guy, man? I've done everything. I need to wait for this stupid ass thing now. Like, there's there's not enough time. There's not enough time. I waited a bit long on that one. I don't know why I was delayed to start. <sighs> Let's check the weight. Weight, 153. Is it close? Yeah, 145. Height, 6, 510. I think this is the guy. I've got the binoculars. I just need some evidence from his fucking phone, which I keep fucking up. Uh, I don't think there's anything else I can check. No, there isn't. You wanna go, mate? Because he's not showing up on here. Just have to wait for this now. My man Derpy. Let me get through the night or die. Then I'll read what you just came in with, man. Here we go. Clutch it. I'm running out of time. I gotta be quick now. I need to solve two more cases. Search history, how to tell my neighbors are being loud, how to deal, blah, 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 writing neighbors, <laughs> disturbance. Okay, see through fence. This guy might be okay. Kristen, hey baby, enjoy your vacation. Yeah, neighbors, 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 neighbors. I think we're fine. We're fine. No pictures of kids. We're good. This guy is clean. Tear it up, baby. Daniel Hubbard. Let's do this, Daniel. We're gonna be quick on this one. Hold on, have I missed a sound? No? I met my neighbor for the first time today as he came by asking if he could use my bathroom since his plumber shut off the water to let him inside and when he was on his way out he slowed down, stood still and just started admiring things inside my eyes. I appreciate it. He jokingly said, yeah, toss me a key so I can come back anytime. For some laughter, it was creepy. Okay, cool. But now I'm missing a set of keys from my key rack. Good to know. Mama. Pharmacy just called, blah blah blah. I feel f you might want to head down there and get your refill. Prescription. You need to take them. Your father and I are not there to help if something happens. I want to take a break from it for a while. And I even made a new friend next door that trusts me. I'm okay, Ma. I don't have his number. I talked to him for the first time today. Next time I see him, I'll get it. He's really cool. Give me a key to his place and said I could come by anytime I want. Stay away from this man. No stranger gives his key to someone they don't know. Okay. This guy might be a creep. Evidence. Uh, pictures. Fucking weird shit. Okay. Search history. Bipolar off meds. Alternative thing bipolar meds. Meditation techniques. Okay. Good start. What's your name? Hubbard Daniel. Someone's inside. It was good knowing you! Okay. I'm running out of time, dude. Where the fuck is that? Hello? There's no time to check!
We're good, we're good, we're good. I- I need to finish this case! There's no time to check! Come on! At 3.20 a.m. Daniel Hubbard. He's weird dream last night when woke up to go and search his own. Treating myself to a five-star dinner. Forgetting to label some of the moving boxes driving me up. I just thought this person. What? Where are you? No internet connection. There's no time. Oh my god, guys. Do I shred it? Do I look for some last evidence? He's bipolar. And it's- he's- no, but he, there's evidence. He said the keys. He said the keys. He said he's bipolar and he said that the guy gave him keys and in the report he said, I've, I've got missing keys. Is- 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 is the evidence... I mean, I got the search results, but I need more evidence. But I only have one out of two on evidence. Do I do the search results as evidence? How much time do I have? 3.51. Do you think it ends at 4 a.m. or 5 a.m.? I need to get his ID. I need to get his ID. It says one of two. Surely it's enough evidence. Quick ID, and then, okay. <laughs> male? He's male? He's brown and green. Brown hair. Green. Gerald Scott. That's not him. He's 6'6 six, six in height. 6'6. Six, six. That should be enough. You know what this game gives me? This game gives me PTSD. I should have just shredded it. I thought maybe it was 5 a.m. You know, I, I have PTSD from this game because of Welcome to the Game. In Welcome to the Game, so much random shit happens that I could never figure out why it happened. So I'm checking shit all the fucking time. I ha- I ha- I have memories from Welcome to the Game that makes me, like, sp waste so much time going around looking for shit when I need to spend time on- <sighs> He was innocent, I have it all written down. No, I should've just- Why didn't I fucking shred it? Why didn't I shred it? What- You, you know, you wanna know why I didn't shred- well, It's because he's bipolar. It's a bipolar guy, and he said to his mom, who's worried, the guy gave me his keys. How is that innocent? Did the guy, was the guy, did the guy give his keys? And then, and then what? That doesn't make any sense. Are you sure he's uh, innocent? He literally, did the guy who, re did the guy report him, he gave him his keys and then reported him? Why would he, why would he report him with a lie? He was off his meds, his mom was worried, and he lied and said, I got the keys. I don't know, man. I've been playing this for the past two days. Why is that innocent? That doesn't make any sense. Yeah. 
I mean, yeah, maybe it was framed. The mom did say don't trust someone who gives you their keys. I don't know, this game stresses me out. Is Fall Guys servers open? <laughs> He wasn't bipolar, his neighbor was. What? In the texts, did I misread? <laughs> Yoink! Yoink. A speed run. A fucking speed run. Check this out. Derpy! Oh, you know what? Hold on. Wait. <laughs> One second. All guys does work, I, I checked. I had someone else say it was still down. Right, we'll do one more. Derpy with a 10 gifted subs! And... And the 50, you're the same guy, the 50 bucks earlier. Been so busy lately, but always happy to support you. Love what you did for the charity stream. Much love from Canada. Fuck, thank you, man. Thank you so much. Thanks for those 10 subs and thank you for that donation. You're lovely. Thank you, man. Yeah, the charity stream was a good time. Red say with the nine months. Leo Zekov with the four. I decided to join the Corsair Club by getting myself a virtuoso set. Can you share an opinion of the software drivers for the headset? I had Razer Nari Ultimate and I can say the Razer software is complete garbage. Wow. Um, I don't know. It's your classic, uh, pretty classic software. To be honest, I haven't used it a super high amount. Corsair's, um, what do you, the, the IQ software. Um, I've heard it's, uh, it's good. Heard it's all right. But I can't give you an honest personal experience from it as I, I haven't played it, uh, used it too much. Or when I do use it, um, I haven't had any issues, but I haven't gone deep into it, you know, and changed like keys and stuff. Um, so if you're looking to do that, maybe look up some uh, reviews of that. But uh, from my experience, I haven't had any issues with it when I have used the... Um... If you're talking about the program, you said software drivers, but yeah, the whole program I haven't had any issues with. It's uh, When I go into download drivers for it, it's been fine. Hell yeah, man. Good to hear it, Leo. Rat, Rat say with the nine months. Glitch 5632. Xlado with a two. Connor, 32 months. Colin Bidden with a six. Random noob. Today my son asked, can I have a bookmark? And I burst into tears. 11 years old and he still doesn't know my name is Brian. <laughs> That's funny, dude. Uh, the Zeninator, 16 months. I haven't been able to catch a stream lately because I've been working so much to prepare for my new puppy. Thanks for all the continued laughs. And I hope you and Alex are well. Good luck with the puppy, man. Awesome. Yoink! Sorry about that. Uh, Camo Bryce, thanks for subbing, man. And Irgendain Zal with three bucks. I don't get this game, I just want to see you scream. Honestly, there's more just tension than me actually screaming. <sighs> oh, hell yeah, David. 
Right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna try once more. I'm doing a bit of a speed run here. You see, if you do, is it four cases or f I think five cases, you get to go to sleep early. Check this out. You guys ready to be impressed? No, that's a spoiler, exploding kitten. I'm I'm all good, man. I'll figure it out. This brain, this brain is enough to get this sorted. Okay, here we go. First, when I start my day, I sit down. Oh, yeah. I open up the I report need to read disc. That email and check out those disc. bolos. I get an unknown. I open up the DMV DB. His age, 15 to 20. I set it to 25. Height, 6. I, I throw out a wide net. Weight, 155. You know what that means. 125 to 175. Gender, male. Black hair, brown eyes. Black hair? Black hair! Brown eyes, I search. I was babysitting my nine-year-old niece recently, and in her excitement to go to the park, she ran out of the house without me. Got my things and immediately ran after, but couldn't find her after. What seems like I found her hiding in the park. I was fuming mad, but she ran up to be crying. She said something about a strange man attacking a lady in the car. Uh, I tried to calm her down to figure out what happened. She said a lady was moving really slow on the, uh, the orange thing, and he looked up and saw my niece, that everything's going to be all right, little girl, after which she ran out there and found me. I think it was probably some kids pulling around in the backseat. I asked my niece where she saw this happen. She took me over to one of the parking lots, but said the car was gone. Ronald? We're going to... Look up his name. And he's gonna have bought some sort of orange thing recently. Here we go, supermarket. Roasted peanuts. Trench coat and a skull cap. Face paint assorted colors. I don't know. I see no orange thing. What am I doing? What, what am I doing? <laughs> there you go. <sighs> Shredder. On to the next one. Clear that. Unknown. Coming back from getting a late night snack, I passed through the park on my way home. I had my headphones in, but could see a couple of guys hanging around at the picnic tables. I recognized one of them as a personal trainer for fitness, but I turned around and made eye as I waved. He came running up to me away from his fence in a hurry, so I asked if everything was. He got the fence and kept asking me why anything would be on his general demeanor, made me more interested or whatever was going on by the picnic tables. However, he kept moving in front of me like he was trying to give his buddies time to hide something I wasn't supposed to see out of the park. I'm sure, I didn't know what they were doing, but I had a strong feeling that something wasn't right. Okay, mail. Reset this. Mail, 25 to 35. To 20 to 40. Height, 6. Wide net. Hair brown, eyes brown. Gender, Yoink. male. Weight, 215. Search. I did this one? Yeah, I can't remember what happened. Hoyt Powell. Hoyt! Right! The fuck was... What was there... What, what did this guy do? It was drugs. This guy deals drugs. Identification card. Just need the evidence, please. Uh, let's get your... Phone number, so I could do the texts. Hoyt, you're a drug dealer. Ay, 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 ay. That's not good. So, we're gonna open up his social media. That's not good. We need some... We need... We need... Is this the organ guy? I thought this was the drug guy. Maybe I got the wrong guy. Chad. 
has powers, right. Yoink! That's this guy. I, never re I can't remember where this red. Red, let, 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 let. Okay. Did I write Hoyt here? Oh, 19, 50. Okay, cool. Here we go. Text combos. Chat. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's this guy. This guy's a creep. <laughs> Yoink! Okay, nice. Next up. This lady moved into my house across the street a couple months ago, but she hasn't said a word to anyone in the neighborhood. She has her lights on at all times of the night and I never see her during the day. Gets all... Uh, she deals drugs. <laughs> Yoink! Norma, you deal drugs. Let me get your texts. Carlos, don't fuck with me, Granny. I need it right now. Ugh, damn it. Internet went out again. Oh, no. I need to go reset the router in the back no, of the no, no. closet. Yeah! We're done. We're done here. Ship it! Ship it! Ship it! What's this? Today's bonus quota. What's this? Go to bed. I do one more and I go to bed. That hitchhiker that went missing? Yeah, I saw him hop into a car a few nights ago. Pretty recognizable car. It had one of those family set stickers on the back. I no swear there were like five or six uh, kids and two parents. Legit insane. A ton of live, laugh, laugh. Very soccer momish. I saw the lady pull up next to the guy on my way down next. I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying to. Sp Why are they all unknown? Brown, brown. 195. Wait a minute. Hmm. 
This is- this is too stressful of a- Who the fuck is Norma? What am I doing here? Where's- okay. This is, I- I can't- I can't speedrun this, man. I- I- it's- it's- it's too stressful to speedrun. Is she five, five, six? Okay, five to six, six. Lola, 48, five, four. Description fits. She's a little bit on the fatter side, but I got her. Lola Goddle. Got you now. Marcus. There was some meat in the fr if you meet your friends, Gavy, cook it yourself. It's not bad, Lola, I promise. Don't think of it really to my children either. It's yours and one day I'll convince you, don't worry. You're starting to look sickly, Marcus. This can't be good for you and you know it. So you text him going You wanna talk? Papa's sick. It's that weird fucking meat his friends put him on. The meat stuff bothered you? Is he eating human meat? Why is he dying? Weird meat. Marcus Caudle. What the fuck is he doing? <laughs> Yoink! Ella. Does your husband still work at the butchers? Yes, he does. Have Losing Marcus is hard, but we're pulling through okay. He died? What's happening here? What? What did this say? What does this have to do with the hitchhiker that we're missing? Marcus is off again this time to Canada. Papa will be home soon. He's not dead. What? I don't understand. This isn't you. Who the fuck is this? Why am I back to you? What was I reading? Oh, there's many phones. Hitchhiker. Good way to manage grief. Does anyone understand what the fuck is going on? Fuck it, dude. We get to sleep early. I guess that guy was waiting for me behind me on the computer or something. <laughs> One of the windows were unlocked? Yeah, I must have missed something. I was too into my speed run. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking game, dude.